Welcome to Okaboji Broadcast, everybody. Great start to our week as we get uh, close to the... It is really... Kylie Zankowski is here with me from the Iowa Great Lakes Area Chamber of Commerce. This is the last full week of September. I know, it's crazy. I feel like we blinked and summer left us and now September's left us. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, but that doesn't mean we run out of things to do. No, fall is a gorgeous time here. There's so much to do. I feel like every week has still been jam-packed with activities to yeah. do here and the weather is still gorgeous. Not too hot like it was for a little while there in the summer, it's, but it's I call it, the, it's the baby bear porridge. Yeah, yes. Just right. Just right. It's perfect. Well, we've got a big weekend coming up here uh, in Okaboji, and a lot of it's going to be centered right here. And there are other things around the area, of course. But Oktoberfest is coming up this weekend. Yes, it is. We're so excited. We're gearing up for it's the 29th year for University of Okaboji Oktoberfest and the third year for the festival. So it's growing. It's going to be bigger and better than ever. Um, and what great way to social distance outside and enjoy some fall fun in Okaboji. And the weather's looking gorgeous. Yeah. So fingers crossed it stays that way. <laughs> um, but it's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, of course. Well, that's what we do here. That's yes. what we do best, yes. Kylie. Uh, of course, the. Uh, like you said, 29th year, the uh, U of O Oktoberfest uh, bike ride comes yeah. up this weekend. Yeah, yep. So it takes off right here from Preservation Plaza. Uh, bike ride around Westlake Okoboji and Lake Minnewashta. So beautiful scenery, a great thing to do with family, friends. I know the bike trails has been um, kind of a saving grace for a lot of people during yeah. quarantine times. And, and we love to show off those awesome trails that we have here. Um, and then right after the bike ride, we have some awesome activities here for you. Um, Farmer's Market in the Park kicks off in the morning. They've got music starting at 9 in the morning. And we've actually got live entertainment for you for 12 hours from oh, wow. there. So, you know, we've got live music from them until about noon. Then we've got Shirts and Skins on the big stage from 12 to 4. Right. Then Rock a la carte from 4.30 to 6, 6.30. Um, then you can go to Jazzed Up Big Band in the Roof Garden. Wow. So lots of music, lots of different activities. We've got the keg toss, the sign holding competition, the bags tournament. There's going to be a vendor show this year. Um, that's going from 10 to 5. Um, we've got 30 different vendors. So all sorts of shopping you can do. They're all going to be located here. out here. Yeah, yep. Okay. And then fun for the family, too. So the Arnold's Park Amusement Park is bringing out some rides for the kids to enjoy. Yeah. And then we've got inflatables, too. So it's all entirely free for you to enjoy. Um, and it's just a great day filled with lots of Okaboji fall fun. Yeah, it almost sounds like a, a summertime uh, with all the activities and the entertainment. It sounds like we haven't changed anything whatsoever. But, you know, for those people going on the trails, you know, we're starting to see the change of colors. Yes. And what a beautiful thing around the Iowa Great Lakes when leaves start turning from green to red and gold and uh, yeah. just a it's beautiful, beautiful time. Yeah, it's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It's a fun place to be. You know, right now we're looking out at the lake and it's kind of calm and the cool breeze and you can see the different colors starting to pop up around and yeah. it's just peaceful and it's a lot of fun. You know, it's a great time to bring your friends and family to the area to mm -hmm. see the charm of what Okaboji has going on. and. You know, we don't shut down after the summer. A lot of businesses are still open, a lot of fun things to do to make a whole weekend of it. Yeah, got, and you got to remember that, that uh, a lot of our businesses, yeah, we do have some of our seasonal that uh, uh, are getting ready to shut down, but so many of our businesses, our shops, our, our restaurants, uh, still going, everybody practicing yeah. uh, safe social distancing, but, you know, it's still a great time to come to the Iowa Great Lakes and, yeah. and enjoy. Yeah, definitely. We do want to encourage anyone that's coming this weekend to follow the guidelines, safely social distance. You know, we're going to be following a lot of guidelines, encouraging people to spread out. We're going to be doing um, check-in a little differently this year, more spread out and having people take off a little earlier and then come join the fun later in the day. So yeah. it's going to be a fun day, a fun, safe day here in Okaboji. Yes, indeed. And we want to remind people, you know, check the, the Chamber's website and your Facebook page because uh, we mentioned some of the things going on here, yeah. uh, Chamber-based and at the Arnold's Park Amusement Park, but there are different celebrations throughout the Iowa Great Lakes and uh, all your members have got their things listed on there as well. Yes, exactly. So you can go to okabojichamber.com and see all sorts of updates on all activities happening all through the weekend and get a direct link to the Oktoberfest site. Otherwise, it's U of O Oktoberfest.com. Registration closes this Thursday, so you'll want to get your registration in if you haven't yet. Um, we do still have day of registration that morning, okay. um, but for like the tournaments, uh, pinball tournament, bag toss tournament, those registrations, you must register um, beforehand. We might accept a few the day of, but make sure you get your registrations in and it's going to be a lot of fun. Now, is it true everybody from the chamber is going to be dressed in lederhosen this um, weekend? I... <laughs> we'll see. We'll, <laughs> At we'll least see Blade. we got to get Blade yeah, in yeah. somebody. <laughs> 
<laughs> well, wonderful. Well, Kylie, I appreciate you taking time here. And this is going to be a lot of the side of it right here behind us, folks. Uh, of course, over on uh, uh, Lake Street here with Farmer's Market Saturday morning, full day and even into the evening activities for Oktoberfest here in the Iowa Great Lakes. Kylie, thanks for being with us. Thank you, Jeff. Kylie Zankowski here with us from the Iowa Great Lakes Area Chamber of Karma. Commerce. We thank her for joining us. We thank you for watching us right here on Okaboji Broadcast. Okaboji Broadcast with Jeff Thee is brought to you in part by Pure Fishing in Spirit Lake. Last Touch Painting and Cleaning, providing interior, exterior, and house painting and professional cleaning services in Spirit Lake. Okaboji Mattress Company, one mile west of the junction of Highway 9 and 71 in Spirit Lake. Bank Midwest, dream big, plan wisely, live well. And Duckies Marine and Motorsports Repair in Spirit Lake. Lakes Regional Healthcare and Avera Partner. Brands Law Office in Spirit Lake. Ruthven Locker, where carnivores are welcome on Hill Avenue in Spirit Lake. Back Engineering in Spirit Lake. B Radiant Laser Skin Studio, newly located in the Okaboji Plaza in Okaboji. And by Quest Wealth Management, a financial advisory practice of Ameriprise Financial Services. Advisors Jan Spielman, AJ Spielman, and Erica Walkholes.